Everyone, it's Em. Welcome back on my channel. Today's video is going to be a Snapchat Q&A. It's my first time doing one, so I'm not sure how it's going to go, but hopefully it goes well and I will be able to continue doing those. I wanted to quickly answer first a few questions that I've had a lot on Instagram and everything. So first of all, for everybody that is new, my name is Emily. Hi. <laughs> I am a part-time student in law school. I'm also working and I do YouTube for fun. And I'm French Canadian, hence the accent, hence the lack of pronunciation in H's. They don't exist in French. They do, but not the same way at all. So that kind of explains it. <laughs> So I know a lot of you know, but I recently moved. It's my third time this year. Don't even want to talk about it. It's just done now. So I'm not going to be moving anymore. So I'm trying to currently like get into it, like perfectly get installed, but it's been very hectic. I got pretty sick and like midterms and now it's like finals and like I've been traveling. Everything has been so crazy, but I'm finally installed. So I can include a few clips. I know I was supposed to film at fall what it looks like in Canada and I'll include a few little clips, but it was so difficult because the first time I went uh, to like my favorite place to hike, uh, there was like a school, school trip and there was like children everywhere yelling. So I was like, oh, it's super calm here. And you can hear like ah! in the background. So not very yeah wasn't exactly the way it usually is plus the trees like were still pretty green and when i went a week or two after uh there was so many people like a few thousand people because there was an event and i didn't know so next year i will know to go during the week like in the morning or something so i can show you and it's silent but you can still see it's very very pretty so plus the fact that i moved i also wanted to mention that i have to film all my videos in like in one day because during the week there's uh, a lot of construction noise and I can't film like it's driving me crazy even if I try to do like a video that is silent I'm going nuts hearing like the noises so it's not necessarily ideal so today is the first video of the day woke up like this not exactly don't uh, wake up with falsies but I thought the first video of the day could be the Q&A and then I'll like change up my makeup a little bit do my hair a little different and film like five videos so by the way my shirt is from H&M I thought it was pretty appropriate but I realized the girl forgot to <laughs> A little ink thing. I'll have to go back. And my phone case is from uh, Forever 21. I thought that was pretty cute. Rawr. So, if you're wondering, let's do this. So, we have a lot of questions over here. So, let's see what it is. I'm excited. <laughs> What about etc. asked me uh, for my Q&A video and advice for someone who just moved from tropics to Europe and how and now has itchy red and flaky dry skin. I'm actually doing my uh, skincare routine. I filmed it this morning, so technically I lied. This is my second video. Um, so you will see this probably next week. So there will be everything that I like and I have pretty dry, itchy, dry skin. So <laughs> you will see everything that I like, but I do love the... Um, Serum from Clarins, uh, the uh, Hydra Quench one. I'll try to insert a picture. This is awesome. And yeah, it's a little bit of a splurge, but so worth it. Yours truly shall ask, uh, I only love your channel. Thank you. Uh, what eyebrow pencil is better for beginner, the Anastasia one or the NYX one? If you're on a budget, honestly, try the NYX one. It's awesome. I love, I, I love, I love them both. Uh, the Anastasia one, just a little bit more, but honestly, if you're on a budget or just starting out, NYX one is awesome. Okay, first video. I'm a little bit excited. <laughs> Let's do this. Is this okay? Volume on max. Let's do this. I love your hair. <laughs> when will you do a hair care routine? Well, thank you. Uh, my hair used to be so messy, and I've been like obsessed to like trying to get the perfect things. And I will do a hair care routine, but if there's like only one product you can get, I would go and get the uh, Macadamia Oil, the Deep Repair Mask. The it's like a brown and like green uh, pot and it's awesome. You put this in your hair and you leave it for like five minutes and then like wash your body, blah, blah, blah and then you rinse it off and your hair is good. It's just awesome, honestly. I've been through three, four pots of it. I usually get the humongous one on like Amazon. It's like around $45-ish, which is expensive, but it lasts me like two years and I use it once a week around that. So, and that's mostly why my hair looks awesome. It's that mask. Everyone that uses it knows how awesome it is. <laughs> Hi Em, what's your favorite lipstick brand? Greetings from Germany. It's so cool. I love accents. Um, <laughs> favorite lipstick brand? I think I would have to go with MAC just because they have, like just for the sheer amount of differences, different lipstick shades they have. Like you go there and you get so overwhelmed, I know, but there's so many options. There's something for absolutely everyone. So if you're looking for like your first lipstick-ish place, if you find someone that works there that is really, really nice, they will find a perfect shade for you. And yeah, 
probably MAC just because there's so many options. I'm 15, how much makeup can I wear? As much as you want, honestly, but personally when I was 15, I would probably like just wear a little bit of concealer under my eyes and like if I have a pimple or something on there too. And I used to rock the waterline liner. Don't do this, don't do this. <laughs> That's all I was wearing. So I would say honestly, concealer, um, some uh, mascara, maybe some eyeliner if you feel like it, depending on what you like too. So if you're like not a lip lipstick type of person, don't wear lipstick, wear a lip balm. But if you're like really into eye makeup, then wear eyeshadow if you feel like it. I think it's really a balance too. I know schools don't all accept makeup, but I would say concealer, mascara, eyeliner, you're good to go. You're so cute. Um, yes, French is my first language. Technically, I learned English in school, but I'm sure a lot of people can relate with me. Like, I did not learn much in school for English. My parents were from uh, the middle of Quebec, Drummondville. I don't know if some of you know. And over there, you speak English like three words, like yes, no, toaster. That's all you know. So growing up, they did not teach me English at all. So in school, I did learn like, you know, colors, numbers and stuff, but I didn't understand most of it. Like I finished high school knowing like 40% English, like understanding 40% English. And I just ended up Sucking it up at one point and just started listening to movies or uh, any TV series with subtitles. First, uh, I was listening to it in English but French subtitle, then I switched it to English subtitles and eventually just no subtitle and that's what helped me the most, like movies and TV series and YouTube videos actually too a lot. So that's how I did it. I don't know if it works for every language but I feel like English is kind of easy to understand pretty quickly. So that's how I did it. Can I just say it's actually so much fun to see your faces? <laughs> I get very excited. Okay, let's do this. What is your favorite lip color? Love from Florida. I wish I was in Florida. My mom's actually going there this winter for like three months and I'm like so jealous. Uh, my favorite lip color. Uh, there's so many options. I think the easiest way to say it for me, like the easiest one to pick would be like Mac Faux just because I always wear this. It's always in my purse. That and Brave. I just always wear them. They're like the closest thing to my natural lip color. This is my natural lip color. And I feel like it's this, but a little bit more purple, like wearable purple nude. It's awesome. So I was wondering if when you go through and comment, um, or you're looking through the comments on your videos, if you like um, recognize people's username. Yes. And then yes. you're like, oh, well, like they've commented on my videos before yes. or whatever. I know I do it a lot. Um, mine is Black Nail Dry, and you respond to yes. me quite frequently. Yes. I remember you. Very happy. Um, yeah, also PS, you're really crush every day. I'm just, just throwing. I really want to give you a hug. Oh my god, you're so sweet. Yes, I totally remember your username. I'm like almost crying. <laughs> I have a little mushy inside me. Um, yes, I have an absolutely great memory, like freakishly good memory. I will remember things that are like, that happened years ago, like little details. So yes, I totally remember uh, seeing usernames like very quickly. Like I remember in like, I see you people, I see you. And I'm like, oh my God, I have goosebumps right now. Like, okay. <laughs> I don't know why I'm so emotional, but yes, I totally see you. And I love receiving comments from the same person. I just feel like you're all my friends. Like, I just feel really mushy right now. I want hugs. Like when I do meet up, people, I need hugs. I totally need hugs. <laughs> okay, next one. <laughs> Your glasses actually look like mine. Glasses twin. <laughs> I'm so bad at this. I can't even click. Hi. <laughs> do I love, do I enjoy living in Canada? Yes and no. I have like a love-hate relationship with it just because like it's so beautiful. People are nice, you know, like everywhere. Um, the only thing I don't like is the fact that like winter is like eight months a year, which you would think like you see pictures of Canada with like fall, the trees, blah, blah, blah. It lasts two weeks. Literally this year, yeah, the trees were like full of colors for like two weeks and then they were all on the floor. It was raining. It was cold. <laughs> so I love Canada and I love actually, I love winter for like a week or two whenever like you wake up and the, there's like snow everywhere under trees. It's really, really magical. 
but I don't like the cold, so I don't know. I would live part-time somewhere at Worm and then live part-time Canada. <laughs> So yeah, I love Canada. I feel like everyone is like really accepting. Obviously there's assholes everywhere, but I feel like Canada has some really nice people in there. So yeah, I do enjoy living in Canada, but a little cold. <laughs> Woo! That is one good haul, girl. <laughs> By the way, I'm not saying names just because I suck at pronouncing names and I... Let's not go there. Okay. It looks so pretty. Look at this. Wow. <laughs> okay. <laughs> ah! I see you. I see you. Oh. My favorite MAC lipstick. I just said it. Faux. Brave. They're awesome. Bronzer highlight. Or highlight. Pick one forever. That is so mean. <laughs> uh, I think I would go with highlight because I feel like some bronzer could be replaced with blushes when you're fair, but highlight, I need like Laura Mercier forever. Like this color, it's what I'm wearing right now and I'm like, yes, forever on my cheeks. <laughs> TV show you're loving right now. I love so many different TV shows, but right now I'm loving Empire. I feel like if you're not watching Empire, you're wasting your life. <laughs> Child or if you have any brothers or sisters. Ciao! You're so cute. I love accents. Okay, um, I have a little sister and a older brother, so I'm the middle child. <laughs> As you get older, do you think you will leave wing eyeliner? I feel like it's gonna get more challenging, but I don't know. Maybe I will eventually, but I like my wings. I can't see myself anytime soon leaving them for sure. <sighs> okay. <laughs> I feel like half the video I'm gonna have to cut because I'm like, oh, you're so cute. <laughs> a lot of people are asking me out about like how I balance everything out. I'll link it down below. I did a video like 50 random facts about me that there was a lot of questions that I answered there, but I, I know I seem it seemed like I like know what I'm doing and I'm super balancing my time and managing it well and. I don't, honestly, like you don't see like the weekly breakdown of like, I can't do this. <laughs> so like I said, like I'm doing like five videos today, so I'm going, to, going a little cuckoo, but I love doing YouTube and it's just for fun right now. Like it's not my full-time job at all. Like I finish law school and I work part-time and this is just fun for me. It is a little crazy, I'll admit, but I'm having a lot of fun doing it. So I don't want to, I don't want to stop. So that's how I find time to do everything just because I want to do everything. Je t'aime. <laughs> what was that like? <laughs> okay, uh, what would be the perfect day for you? What's the weirdest thing about you? If you had a superpower, what would it be? Superpower, I would do this and be anywhere for sure. Weirdest thing about me? I, I don't know if it's that weird, but I do so many faces and I have to edit my videos like crazy because I'm always like, you've noticed like my eyebrows are doing their own thing all the time and I just make faces and when I don't know what how to say something I just start doing this and in real life people just look at me like what are you doing but on the internet I can kind of cut a little bit my videos but I feel like it's like starting to come out more and more so is that weird maybe what would be a perfect day for you can I be really cheesy and say I would love to do meetup actually I need to make this happen because yeah, I want to meet you. <laughs> Oops. No, I know you're referring to, the, uh, I posted earlier uh, this week a picture there was snow on the floor and she was saying we're lucky. No, 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 no. <laughs> I don't want winter yet. I'm not ready. Actually, I should have, did I forget to put the, aw, uh, should have done that earlier. Are you ever going to visit New York? I would love to meet you. I would love to meet you too. Honestly, I would travel like anywhere, anytime because I love to travel. I don't get the chance to do it very often because I've been like in school like hardcore for such a long time, but it's gonna happen. I've been to New York in the past, but I need to go again. Hello, what's your most favorite and affordable eyeliner that you use, you like to use? P.S. you have a wonderful channel. Much love takes this beautiful girl. Thank you, love you too.
Um, I will go with the NYC uh, eyeliner. It's a little bit of a, you know, there's a learning curve because it's like a, I don't know where it is actually. I wanted to use it this morning. I couldn't find it. Um, it has, oh my God, classic. The only thing is the little brush is like, like this, like a little bit old school. So there's a learning curve, but it's the blackest eyeliner ever. And it's awesome and it's matte, which is my only issue with the uh, Stila one. But if you can learn how to use it, it's awesome. Hi, Emily. Could you tell me what mirror you use to put your makeup on? Thank you. Uh, I actually use this mirror right here. That is actually pretty dirty. Oops, you saw the whole thing. <laughs> uh, yeah, I think I got this set winners, but you can find them pretty much anywhere. And in front of a window is like the best way to do it because there's like natural lighting. Very unforgiving, but at least you know what it looks like. Last but not least, let's do this. Who's your favorite YouTuber? I have so many, but I've been watching a lot of Shannon's video right now, Shannon XO. Uh, she's one of the first people I've ever uh, found on YouTube. Actually, the first video I've ever seen on YouTube, fun fact, was a what's in my bag video. I need to do one of those just because of that, but yeah, and then I eventually found some people and one person that I'm still watching regularly has to be Shannon, so yeah. So that was really fun. I have to do it again really soon. You're so cute. You just sent it as I was finishing and I needed to include you. I just want to hug everyone, seriously. This is making me too mushy. This has to stop. <laughs> so that's it guys. I hope you enjoyed this video and it was fun. I loved seeing your faces. Seriously, we need to do this again really soon. You can ask me any weird questions. Actually, leave some down below and I'll answer them in a future Q&A too, but keep some for the next one. <laughs> so that's it guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and just subscribe to not miss any future videos and I will see you in my next one. Bye.